Chat is set up. Discord is notified. Log in. Hey, Maxman, welcome to the stream, man. Thought you were going to be on the stream on Wednesday. Surprise. How's it going? Thanks for joining. Oh, loudness. Loudness ensues. How loud was that? Eh, not that loud, okay. Let us continue the game from where we left off last time. You forget it was Sunday? Well, I didn't because I go to work to. I have to go to work tomorrow. So I am more than. more than acknowledged about the fact that it's Sunday. <laughs> yeah! And, uh,. As previously, we have landed on Mars successfully. I'm not really sure why we wanted to do that. I thought it would probably just be fun. But we did it. With this half of a half of a ship, very unfinished, using uh, five parachutes and like 70 engines, I think, or uh, thr thrusters. But yeah, we managed to land safely without almost any damage. Oh my god, he, he made it even better. I have three now. Cool. But today, I want to build a big-ass ship, not this thing. It's, it's fun and all, but, you know, I want something of my own. But first things first, we need to go back into space. <clears throat> and to do that, I am going to attempt to use this huge ass ship. And hopefully get us in space? Question mark? Dampeners? Oh, I just turned off the goddamn ship. Ship is on. Dampeners are on. I don't know if that's going to help me. But let's just try it out. It's not connected to the planet in any shape or form. It's literally just standing on its engines, so... Alright. Does it work? It, it's not working. Do we not have... What is happening? I've got these things. Do we need to be, like, off of the... Ow. Off of the actual... These are not working at all. What's happened to my ship? Hmm. It's also slowly moving. If I go full front, it, it wants to move. But not really. Are we too... We're probably too heavy for this thing. To get out of here. So hey, it wasn't it wasn't that simple that we actually landed on the planet. It looked really simple, that's why I thought it was simple, but to my surprise, this thing cannot get from this planet. Or something's wrong with I have an idea. He has put some I don't know if they're still here. Yeah, they're still here. The railguns might have just killed the reactors. 
Can I see some info? Max over three megawatts. But how am I going to get off? I'm I'm gonna try and use my small ship to get out out of here. But I'm also going to. Ow. I'm also going to try and put some new reactors in. You know, let's just replace those that are there. Where is... Uh, do I have a reactor? A big one? Somewhere? I don't. Yeah, I mean, it has an antenna. So, we should be good with that. I don't... I don't need, need it. And we know that it's on the planet Mars somewhere. So, you know, that's a good point to... Rejector. I need a reactor. It's an easy way to find it. All right, delete, 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 and... I mean, I hear the engines work and stuff, so... They were probably working even before. Yeah, this thing is not getting out, out of here. Hey, Derps, how's it going? I just called you derps. I'm sorry, but I did deal with it. Yeah, this thing is not going anywhere. I don't know what's wrong with it. Hold up. What if we increased thrust override? You can, you can override the thrust. I didn't know that. We could maybe need only just one thruster, uh, thruster like this to get, to have like a very good moving ship. What do you think? Anyways, let's figure out how to get this piece of thing off of that thing without actually how am i going to do that without this thing crashing it's more than one of me <laughs> the world isn't ready for that that's true why do you have side engines how do you not understand that you need engines in all in all directions yep i'm still on the ground All right, it's good to see that this works, but what I don't know is how to turn off the magnetic pads all at once. Do I have to put all of them on my on my thing here? Because that's going to be just... Unlock. 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 Can't wait for this to take ages and then we just smash into the planet. And we're probably going to roll over, like, on, on, on the... On the backside, which is not good. Don't worry, this is not going to be something I have to do twice. If we if we successfully get this thing off of this planet, I am using or oh we have to fix something. <laughs> it's burning up. It's kinda destroying itself because it's on and firing into the ship. Oh, it's the planet. They good? Okay, cool. I have more time. Do we have all of them? Clutch be dead and died damage. I see, I see. Uh, it's not for me. Uh, unlocked, 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 unlocked. And they're locking back. I hate this. I hate this so much. You know what? 
screw it. I'm getting this thing out of here. One way or the other. You probably can bank action groups. I just don't know how. Yep. It definitely fell that way. Actually... It's nicely balanced, but I feel like that if I delete this part of the ship, it will fall this way and we're gonna be golden. Michael, welcome to the stream, my man. Glad, glad to see you join. This is my first Space Engineering stream of yours. What do you do in this game? Uh, it's, imagine it kind of like Minecraft, but in space. You can build whatever you want and stuff like that, but I'm currently playing on creative because I just want to build but you have a survival which which is much dif much more difficult because you need like oxygen power and stuff like that so you know minecraft but in space with guns and cool spaceships if you can build them currently <clears throat> we are on the planet mars where i started then i got into space then we repaired this huge ship well repaired we put a lot of engines on the back, and then I backed back on to Mars using the engines on the back. Successfully, almost didn't destroy anything, but right now we're stuck again on Mars, and I kind of want to build a new ship, and we need to go to space. So I've al already realized that this thing is not capable of getting back up. <laughs> it was only capable of slowing down enough so it doesn't destroy itself, and I'm going to be using my smaller first ship, to get out of here but first i need to um, make it level and then hopefully it's going to be able to fly away all right maxman have a good one for now well first things first before oh These freaking magnetic paths. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. So it is going to flip itself over if, uh, you know, if I make, make ways. <laughs> you love the sauce on Green Wheel? Is that sarcasm or, or do you really? And also, is it too loud, by the way? I haven't I haven't asked. And yes, I'm eating chips. Don't judge me. Uh garlic chips. Whoa! Why am I doing it? the hard way and why is there a dust storm on mars let's just do it the easy way so dumb goodbye beautiful ship i might one day let, uh, go and rescue you with like viewers and stuff so they can do the work for me please don't destroy yourself i believe uh, yeah. well I mean, sorta. It's definitely better than before. I just realized that I'm... Okay, good. We still have enough space for this ship to not, you know, <laughs> fall over. Fancy check chips? Uh, yeah, kinda. We, we are kinda well known for making chips, actually. Alright. <clears throat> Can this thing go up? No. Negative. This thing can go only forward or backwards ish. If I'm going to be able to, I'm probably going to send you some chips like a like a carriage pack because we, we, we have really, really good chips. Yeah, this thing is not going up. Uh, remember that I put a bunch of things on it in space so you know there wasn't any weight to consider 
Right now we have all the... Wait, consider it. Come on! Yes! Yes! I made it! So the engines on the bottom are not enough, but the engines at the back, which I've upgraded, are enough. And we are successfully leaving Mars, and we are on fire. And I can't really fix it right now, so... Hopefully it's not gonna ex explode? Question mark? <laughs> Goodbye, my beautiful ship. Damn, that's, that thing is huge. Look at that. You can see it from... Well, now I can't because of the text, but like three kilometers away. I believe if I have chip chips, I'm eating them all in two minutes. I have zero self-control. We have big, big, big bags as well. Probably not like American-style big bags. You guys are crazy over there. Hey, how can you get almost a liter of Coke in McDonald's? That just baffles my mind. <laughs> like your large Coke in, in fast food chains is just like... I've seen videos, man. I've been on YouTube. <laughs> We're still really, really pulled towards the planet, so I'm not gonna take our chances. But the, the thing on the back has to be kind of repaired as soon as possible. Over a liter. That's just insane to me. Like the largest thing you can get here is a half a liter. Like in McDonald's, like Coke or something. I remember when, when we were in, in uh, at a Vietnamese shop where they usually get like stuff from Germany and, and Poland and stuff like that. Or places like that. I've had my first can that was like three quarters of a, of, of a liter and that's just insane I wasn't scared I didn't jump it didn't jump scare me at all did you guys get scared quick trip there are cups you can give them <laughs> Jesus Christ a slushies <gasps> okay I'm actually down for that like a uh, half a, a liter of coke eh but but a liter or over a liter of uh, of slushy oh sign me up please i know that those are even worse with like sugar and stuff but yeah i like them yeah cuz they they're gonna stop and then they're not gonna stop for the next 10 hours <laughs> of just driving so yeah they need they need huge ones we're almost out of the reach of mars by the way we're 0.23 g's whoops That was pretty simple, by the way. The engines at the back are doing all of the good work. <laughs> the ones at the f at the at the bottom are just like meh, meh. And we have even less at the at the top, but you don't really need that that much. Yay, unskippable ad. Beautiful. I swear to God, whatever YouTube did just made ads during stream obnoxious as hell. It's like every few minutes, 17 unskippable ads. It's like, you've been watching the stream for 10 minutes. Now give us 15 more minutes to watch advertisement. Hmm. Questions. How's it going? <laughs> Welcome to the stream. 
How many Jews are on Mars in this game? I actually don't know. Um, you can go back in the stream and check, actually. When I was still on, on the planet. You can't swim? I'm also built different. It's called um, Ad Block. Swimming is fun. Deep water is not so fun. It's scary. The G counter, uh, look down on the hotbar. And then on the right side of the hotbar, you have this circle with the with the with the cross in, in the middle of it. And right next to the circle you have A gravity and P gravity. So we're we're losing the P gravity. Damn, this is pretty. 0.9G, really? That seems too much. Doesn't Mars have, like, lower? Yeah. Maybe it's counting it like... It's maybe the pole? So one is, like, 100%. So you know that you're as close as possible. I don't know. This is pretty cinematic, by the way. What is in my eye? Stop it. Here's a question. What is 48 plus 6? Well, that would be 54. I think. Is that plus or oh it's divided i'm sorry i'm i have a small small monitor is it eight no what do you mean stupid look at this do you see how small it is yeah Eight times six equals 40, uh, 48, yeah. I know that that one rhymes specifically, so it's easier to remember. Four times eight. I mean, six times eight. <laughs> 48. Oh, you're stupid, yeah. I mean, that's true, yeah. Cool, everything's, everything's good then. You can't rhyme A with A. I just did. Okay, that that was a little mean. But I I mean it in love, of course. Of course, it's what is it called, harsh love or something like that. I might be the worst streamer. I'm just stuffing my face with chips. Anyways, I don't know if you've noticed, but we're in space. We are zero 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 on the G's. Ta -da. I mean, I know that the ship is self-stabilizing right now, but it wouldn't move either way. Look. Ta -da. We're in space. Space. Every time I say the words we're in space, I instantly remember portal to the ending. I'm in space. Space. That's yeah, that's true. I wanted to try something. When I was going up, I was kind of thinking about something. We need to do a little bit of a disassemblage, but it's all in the name of science, okay? I know, I know, it pains me to see it as well.
Now you are floating in space. You are also floating in space. My poor ship, yeah. Yeah. It is hurting, don't worry. Because I have an idea. <laughs> and you know what that means. Something very stupid's about to happen. I know it's probably not gonna let me do do this, but I I'm I'm trying, all right. Yeah, it would be just floating. One day I saw a creepy face and it ran, bro. I mean, wouldn't it be cool to have just like one huge ass goddamn engine at the back? It's not even that big. Oh, it is connected, I think. Is it? Wait, are we connected or are we not? Um, um. I don't know if I can move forward. Nope, or definitely not. Connect it. If your engine goes out, you have no backup. Starships have 30 other engines for you. <laughs> I don't know who, if you realize who you're talking to. <clears throat> you are speaking of rules my universe don't abide by. <laughs> Yeah. Sadly, do you? What do you mean, sadly? <laughs> All right, plan B. This is this one's gonna be probably even worse. Just so you know. I sadly won't take your advice. I'm building more engines now. Don't you see? Whee! They're spinning. This this plan is definitely going to be worse. Just so just so you're we're abundantly clear on that. Oh hell yeah. Uh Oops. Do you need all the engines? <clears throat> what is that question even? Yes, I do need all the engines. If I wouldn't need all the engines, I wouldn't be building all the engines. This going this thing is going to be like every drag car ever. It's going to be really good for one thing. <laughs> oh, how much I hated the Ah, oh. oh, thank God. Uh What am I doing? Thought I was the different way. Make sure your thrust is central. Central? Like symmetrical, I mean? You mean? I sadly can't fit two engines here. So, we are gonna do one of these. Isn't that lovely? I mean, over your center of mass. Yeah, that's that. 
<laughs> Do we want to put more engines? Whoa. I know, I know. What 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 is that question even? All right. <clears throat> I am the way you make a family is not a family friend until we meet again. What? The way you make a family is not That's true. It's not family friendly to 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 um you know what? You know what? It actually looks more like a ship right now. Ish. <laughs> it looks like you have a cockpit, then you've sliced a different ship uh, into uh, the back, and then you've put a different part of the ship, a different part of another ship to the front. Another. Oh, Jesus Christ. These ads are just non stop. Should we try this out? What do you think? Hey Max, welcome to the welcome to the stream, man. All right, we're trying this thing. And afterwards, I have a special something something that I want to try as well. It turns a little worse than before. Actually, hold on. We can we can make we can make this a bit easier. Oh, hell yeah. Now it turns like crazy. That's maybe a little too much. Finished Red Dead, Red Dead 2. Hell yeah. How did you like it? And how long have you cried for? Why are these engines red? Are they not connected to anything? Question mark. The fairway tree. Mm, what is that? Oh. Okay, this turns very, very well. Maybe, maybe a little too well. Let's see it from the inside. Look at how fast this turns. And then I can just remap my thingies here. How do you do the shooty shoot? Michael told me how to do this so I can use like my mouse and stuff, but I don't know. No. Stop! <laughs> yeah, we don't need a button to shoot constantly. Then you get upset because I got spoiled. Oh, That's even worse. It's a book series audiobook. I see. Never heard of it. Actually, I mean, it sounds kind of something like I should know. Oh, right. Block weapons. I'm dumb. That's it. That's how you do it. So we have... Hell yeah, boy! I had max high order. No. I mean, that's, that's very important for a good finish. It's sad either way, but it's literally heartbreaking if you have, uh, if you have low honor. All right, Maxman, have a good one. Take, thank you very much for stopping by. I have the memes. I have become all powerful. So we have uh, 
Gatling guns. Nice. Then we can switch to rocket launchers. Ooh. Fancy. And then we can switch to our railgun. Which I have a feeling that it's going to totally delete all of the power I have on the ship. That's a lot of usage, Jesus Christ. But we're still good. <laughs> All right, let's 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 see this thing. Whee! Look at the speed. It's literally eating all of our power. All of our power is going into the bag things. Bag engines. Oh yeah, there's chat. Oh, it's 100 meters per second. Oh, you can't see the speed, nothing to compare it to. Um. I mean, it turns on a dime. I love how in space something looks very, very close. But then you try and go to it. And you realize it's going to take you 15 minutes. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah, it's not taking ages. No, don't worry. <laughs> Damn, I should I should really have like a soundboard on on go because yeah, elevator music would just fit in beautifully right now. Yay, we're here. I mean, we're pretty fast. The rock is huge. It stops even pretty well. I mean, there's huge two engines in the front. <laughs> Weep. Let's try some of our weapons. We can destroy these asteroids. Oh! Fly away! Rocks are coming our way! Oh, they're disappearing. Can literally demolish this whole asteroid, but it would take ages. You can't even mine here. I mean, it makes sense because you need stuff. Maybe that's something mineable, actually. Hmm. I would need some kind of a scanner that tells me what ores I can have. Hmm. Antenna. Ore detector. That's the thing. Ore detectors detect ore within a limited radius and mark makes them show up on your HUD. Okay. How to get goodbye or better that I can see It's a it's a it's a do spam. What is that? We have an ore detector. How do you make it work? <laughs> Small reactor, large reactor. 
Wait, did I put an ore detector or is it another gyroscope? That looks uh, exactly like a gyroscope. Yeah, we have a... What a dumb, dumb, dumb person I am. Yeah, there we are. <coughs> On. Is this something? Hey, I am through. It is. <laughs> I was right. It, it is something. It's iron. All right. A rail gun. That was loud as hell. Jesus Christ. I mean, that's one way of mining, right? I know that we could somehow collect it, though. You like talking like you're in the 90s, 1930s? I mean, I like that kind of as well. Hey! We can have miners on the ship as well and just mine and collect the ore. <laughs> Let's wait for a little bit. I'm just gonna fly through here. And this thing really goes. We have some ore here as well. Cobalt. Ah! Oh. That was pretty sick. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. Is that Bob or Golly? Uh, uh, yes. Did he? I was hoping for some blips, signal blips. I want to go and find something, you know. Oh, you're talking KSP terms. I see, I see, I see. That's why I'm so lost. Actually, let's stop right here. This is a good place. Open place. Open sp with, with, uh, with enough open space. And let us begin. Uh, am I moving or is the ship moving? Oh, the ship was moving. Let us start building the huge ship that I am, that I put in the thumbnail and title and stuff like that. <clears throat> I'm just waiting for a freaking ad to end on my goddamn stream. Stop it! This is so annoying. All right. It was by YouTube. My girlfriend has it. So it's on the TV all the time. I uh, I don't have it. And I don't want it. Oh, YouTube Premium. Alright. <clears throat> Without any further ado... This is so di dis disorienting. I don't know which way is up, and I'm still trying to, you know, fix my ways. <laughs> but you cannot do that. There is no certain way up. Michael, welcome to the stream. Greetings, greetings. Let me get our building blocks. So, I guess let's do it with the light armor. Probably should be with something better but light armor it is cool now i know which way is up <laughs> or is this like free placement oh, so disoriented 
All right. How many did I do already? Four, right? Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cool. Was that ten? Yeah, we have a ten. Just finished D&D. &D. Let's go. How was it? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that's right. Derp also is a D and D fan. Totally forgot about the streams that you did with Tommy and Fox and other names that I forgot, but I know they were there. We have a thing, yes. We're doing level 21 shot. Doesn't tell me much, but it sounds fun. They were a very funny scene. All right, so welcome to my new ship. <clears throat> Is this big enough, by the way? Should we, should we do bigger? What do you think? I'm going for a Minecraft block, if you want to ask. Hey, typical, how's it going? Well, enjoy your stream once you start. Thank you for stopping by. It's a popular VR game. No, I don't know. It's max level in game, you usually don't get to in normal games. I see, I see, I see. 2 minus 2 on that size. That's an old block, I think. Minecraft block, indeed. It's 10 by 10 right now. I don't know if I should do it bigger or not. I was, because off stream, I was thinking about like, hmm, what am I going to do? And I thought of building a big ship because I, you know. I really want to do the have a big ship and have a smaller ship exit out of it and fly out and then get back in. Yeah, that'd be that'd be really cool if we, if we could get to that. Isn't a Minecraft block 16 by 16? Well, here you go. You've you've made it easier for me right now. Uh, we have 10 here, so I oh, was 32 by 32. That makes sense. But that's gonna be enormous. <laughs> Is it 16? I'm so lost at, at right now. Anyways, uh, whoops. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay. And now this way as well. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Cool. What am I doing? I just said two, four, three, six. What what is that counting even? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And close it out. Okay, that's gonna be that's gonna be probably the right side, I think. It's like big enough, but also not the most enormous thing ever. It'd be cool if you could somehow like click like right there, right there, and it would fill up the whole it would fill up the whole thing. Alright, alright. How how should I call you? Hmm questions? I'm gonna call you Q for for an ease of saying. So okay Q. <laughs> that was weird. Wait, you, did, did you thought of the same thing, Derp? How and why are you in my head? This noise is killing my f f brain thingies. Green minds think alike. <laughs> One green mind. 
Akasaka Yuzmi. <laughs> Who's the mid one? Sixteen. Well, in your, well, you're in your mid twenties, so. Wow. He's calling me old and stupid at the same time. Hmm. You're too good, him. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna remember that saying, you saying that, for no good reason. It's just you know, or when time comes. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Actually, that one could have been there, but whatever. Bros waiting ten years old. I'm not gonna call you old. I'm just gonna wait until you do something stupid like you, uh, like you're kind of used to doing. So, you know, it's just a matter of time. <laughs> Revenge is a false game, nice. But I don't want to, I'm not gonna, I'm, wait, I'm never gonna forget what Derp old Driscoll did to me. He killed my sister, Arthur. Or something. Wait, not sister. His loved one, I think. Is there really not an easy way to place these blocks? Is it, by the way, how loud is it? Because for me, it's just like... It literally feels like I'm putting the blocks inside of my head at the moment. Rose is going to be on his deathbed thinking about a child insulting. <laughs> I'm going to be on my deathbed slaying a hella, hella bitches. Uh, what? It's good. Is there a fell block tool? I don't think so. I'd love to say that yes, but eh. can't seem to like you know drag and it is a bit tedious. Yes. I mean, you said it's gonna be 16 by 16. I had it 10 by 10. You know, you've you've added a a whole lot of blocks. So yes, I'm saying that it's your fault, typical. Yeah, we have one wall done. Why am I gonna kill dogs? What? Oh. I just realized. Funny. I'm not gonna stop only only at only at dogs. I'm also gonna count in some some cats as well.
You started with it. I just added on to it, you know? This is taking ages. No, el gato es... El, la gata es mi favorita. <laughs> and this thing is starting to be a bit... Huge, not gonna lie. I mean, it already, al always was, but, you know... With the walls, you actually realize how big it is. <clears throat> and the fact that I could very easily park my smaller ship inside of it many times <laughs> This is a good, uh, this is a good, uh, pointer, point, pointer finger. Is that how you say it? Uh, training, not gonna lie. This one was very fast, I have to say. So I'm gonna probably just, you know, angle myself in the same way for all of them. Cause this way it, I don't know, it felt, it felt the faster, f fastest. Just make sure to light it before you close it, space zombies. <laughs> We're, we would need some. We would need some uh, power in there already, so lights are gonna have to be secondary. And I also kind of wanna. I kind of also wanna see how how dark it's gonna be once it's, you know, once it's finished. And we have one left. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Look at what I just built in the middle of the space. Took you a minute to that side. Oh, you're counting me? Or timing me, I mean. Alright, let's see it from, from the inside of this ship. Jesus Christ. Let me just like... I have to keep in mind that this thing doesn't really stop that well because it's really heavy. <laughs> Wee! Hold on. Oh, so small! <laughs> Wee! And so fast. Jesus Christ. The acceleration on this thing is just enormous have to just hear bang why i'm a, i'm a good pilot come on man i literally parked 150 
million kilogram weighing spaceship on Mars using only back thrusters to slow down. Come on. <laughs> Whoops. You're not, you're not gonna slow down using bad thrusters? That's irrelevant. The ship had only the back thrusters. It didn't have any front thrusters. It wasn't built in the front. It, it was just a, a, a space for a bunch of parachutes and, and a seat. We are done! Almost. Ta-da! Our cube has been finished! Parachutes were a crutch though. <gasps> 53 seconds? Hell yeah! I wasn't even thinking about it. Maybe because I wasn't thinking about it, it actually, I improved. Because if I would be thinking about it, I would screw up. Alright, turn off this. Okay. I can safely say that it's pretty dark in here. Let me... Uh... And I'm standing here. I can walk. This is my only light. <laughs> Creeper his. Imagine some kind of like, like you know, dark. What is that? Sprit mining carriage. It's getting closer to us. All right, boys. We might have a situation here. I don't know why a mining rig is trying to get here, but. He's gonna mine in my cube, that's true! Okay. We have to think fast. Think fast and act fast. Large reactor. Built. Nice. We have power. Totally uh, Totally irrelevant, but whatever. Huge antenna. Wait. Uh, beacon is probably better, right? Wait, beacon, beacon, beacon. Bacon. It's a small bacon. I want big bacon. Oh, that's a big bacon. Ye yeah, boy. Is it still coming? It is still coming. Alright. We have a beacon. I'm not gonna I'm gonna, gonna you know. What happens if you put a thruster in the cube? Uh I would need a a seat to And the cube is so huge that the lights don't even go all the way up. Yeah. Uh I would have to uh put a seat here as well. And I don't want heavy armor. I want light armor. Why do I have heavy armor here? Oops. And I don't know if if it would if it would move it. It is a lot of weight. Like we're gonna look at how how much this thing weighs when when I uh, when I get back. Fox, welcome to the stream. Keep it like I don't know the thruster wouldn't do anything. So this is what I'm curious. Well, pro then, then it probably wouldn't do anything. <laughs> Happy. All right. I hope you're gonna, you know, broadcast your position as far as possible because I'm about to go 9.2 kilometers away from here. It's not coming to us. It looks like it's going to that planet, but I want to intercept it and attack it. Onwards! Look at how fast we are. We're at full speed already. We're also draining the full thing. The full ship is being drained by that. <laughs> that very unnecessary back engine. Do we still have... Yeah, we still have signal from that and beacon. Nice. He's over 9,000! 
How are you, Fox? Long time no talk. Six kilometers. 5.7. Let me check. Do we still do we still have visual of the beacon? Yes, we still have visual of our cube. This thing is loud as hell. I feel like the good entry attack is gonna be railgun, and once we shoot it with the railgun, we can do whatever. Thank you, Tip. Thank you very much. Have a good have a good stream as well. Take care, my man. I see it. I don't care if it wants to kill me. I want to kill it. <laughs> <laughs> you might make some friends oh, okay okay slowing down actually turn off the dampener so we just glide to it hello oh my god it's shooting at us what did I tell you We are on fire, I have to fix it before it blows up. Fury. <laughs> How many rockets do I have? Probably unlimited because I'm creative. There's nothing going to be left of you. Alright, let's see the damage. Oh my lord. Oh. Oh. I need to fix you. It's not stopping because it has only one engine on that side. Something's on fire! That was pretty cool! We survived. I when it started shooting at me, I was I was a little worried that we're not gonna survive. But we did. There's I mean this ship is very good, but there's one very big issue, and that is that we have literally zero armor. This ship is only put together by things that do something. There's not like armor or any kind of block or anything like that, so you know. Salvage station. Hmm, interesting. Pretty far away as well. Assailant. What is that? Also, where's the the part of the the wreckage? Probably flew away into space, right? Yeah, and we're never gonna see. <laughs> Damn it! I wanted to look at it at least. Which way was I pointing? This way, right? Yeah. Oh, I kind of wanted to look at. It. I'm I'm gonna look at what that is. If it's if it's it's not on the planet because the planet is fifty five fifty nine kilometers away from us. This could very well be the other part of the ship, the assailant, maybe, because you know it's called the assailant. But first things first, we have to figure out what has happened to our ship. And what do we don't need? This we don't need. No, I'm probably gonna lose these as well. 
So we're just gonna be like, let's leave it like this. And then I'm gonna have to rebuild the whole right side of the goddamn ship. <laughs> What in the f antenna? Okay. It's shooting at me. My reputation with Spurt has dropped. I don't care. Is it done? Looks like it's done. Recon is... Yeah. I was kind of thinking about it that as well. Is this just like an antenna that... It's the smallest little thing ever with just like a little tiny, teeny tiny thing. Access denied. I don't care. This is so cool, actually. It's so well put together. Just like little kind of recon and I also lost a bunch of reputation because of this where's my ship oh there it is the bad and the ugly <laughs> all right <clears throat> so loud why is everything so uh, enormously loud Right. Then we have some batteries. Do I have batteries here? How is it put here? Put in here? Okay. Whoops. Nice. We're almost back to how it looked previously. It was pretty fast. Didn't actually need that much of a that many that many repairs to be honest. I'm just going to add like one here to the side. Welcome back. We're almost fully repaired. If it's is it like this? Yes. All right. Oh, still a few missing. to the front yes that's a small reactor it's a battery are they like not connected to anything it like it kind of looks like they're not connected to anything or they're just maybe not not charged up because they are glowing red. Question, yes. How are the engines getting fuel? Well, let me tell you one very cool thing. Wait, what did I just delete it? Was that a reactor? Yes, it was. Uh, they are not getting fuel. I mean, they don't need to 
really get fuel because creative. Does that answer your question? We have malfunctioned reactor here as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it makes sense that <laughs> it has to get the power somehow, and it's currently not really doing that. Gyroscopes right here. Do we have this battery is also done, but I can't really disassemble it because I think that all of the things that are connected to it would then not be happy. But I guess since I'm doing this, let's try it out. All right, cool, nice. This one's gonna be a little bit, a little bit difficult, a little bit more difficult, I think. Okay, all right, cool. <laughs> we are fully fixed. All right, and we need... We need also the antenna back. So let's put the antenna like right here. Is your big cube still have a beacon? Uh, yes. Right there. Can I like tuck away the antenna under us? Is it still gonna work? Hopefully. Yeah, it is. It, it does work. Nice. <laughs> Alright, I think we should be set. I just needed to put back my rail guns and we are set. Such a beauty. <laughs> Valen, how's it going? Kamu, welcome to the stream, guys. Greetings, greetings. Alright, we're fully fixed. Let's try it out. Okay, it's still turning very well. Maybe I could add one more gyroscope somewhere. Maybe at the bottom. Yeah. Just add one right here. Oh, hell yeah. Woo! Four viewers. Yeah. And. <laughs> it's good. Nice. Nice to hear. Alright, let's see what the SPRT assailant is. I have a feeling that it's... It is part of the ship that I demolished. But we'll see. And then I'm going back to the cube. How far is it? 1.5? Alright, right, right. Uh oh, it's turning at us. Woo! Another one that wants to kill me, huh? All right. You got it. <laughs> I forgot about the shooty shoot stuff. About the machine guns. 
Is it still moving? Or did I disable it? Nope, it's still moving. Oh, it's getting demolished. All right, and we're good. <laughs> This one didn't stand a chance. There's still something shooting at me. Oh, it's one of these again. I missed! Woo! Got it. <laughs> Goodbye. Alright, let's... Let's check this out. <clears throat> Was there even anything in in here? That's a beacon, okay. Just a bunch of engine, I mean thrusters. Is that it? I, that was the gyrosco <laughs> gyroscope. And what is that? Stop it! No! <laughs> I wanted to look at the panel. It was some kind of a ship. What does assailant mean? Isn't it like someone that's that's that that wants to attack you? Not what I'm not sure what the translation is. A sail end. Nice. All right, that was very easy of a fight. I'll be completely honest. That was not difficult. I don't think we even even did get any sort of damage. Something is off back there again. I don't know what it is. It's kind of is that the ba oh it's the battery at the back that holds a lot of things together. Yeah, that battery cannot be changed. That might be a, a slight flaw in the design. Putting like nine engines on top of a battery. So yeah, that battery is going to be dead forever or until I, you know, rip apart the whole back of the ship. Or I'm going to figure out a way to charge it somehow. I'll try just repairing it once I get out. So the reputation with the SPRT went down, huh? Hey, the cube! It is so humongous that it's visible from very far away. I also should make sure that I don't bump into it. All right. <clears throat> so, what do we do what do we have to do with this is put very large engines on it. I was thinking putting the engines inside so we have, you know, it still looks like a cube and doesn't have like engines all over it. But I guess it doesn't really matter. I 
I just... You know what? I'm going to go full crazy on with this one. Full crazy with this one. Uh... Yeah, let's let's leave this here still. Just because, you know, reasons. So, large iron thruster. We need them to point in every direction so we have good maneuverability. They're already on. Nice. Let me try and make some kind of array on this side and we could try and do this kind of an array on all the sides. Should make a door. Yeah, that's true. But nay, hey, let's figure that out later. First, we need to power this thing. I mean, I have a feeling that this is going to be enough for one side. What do you think? Now, if I do this on all sides, I wonder how much freaking power we're going to need. Can't even, like, really imagine how much power this is going to cost us. I guess we're just going to have to try and, you know see if it works or fails <laughs> this is kind of mental not gonna lie cool game it is it is a very 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 cool and fun game originally from czech developers i say originally because i'm not sure if they sold it or not oops it's also moved on this side What am I building? Nothing. I am building a, a, a big cube. Minecraft looking ass cube. Which is actually going to be a spaceship. I know. It's a... It's probably... Ha have It probably most likely have been done already. And it is quite a stupid idea. But I feel like it's going to be funny. <laughs> and I really wanted to build a big ship. And I didn't know... Well... Thinking of, uh, like, a very cool design for a huge ship feels like it would take a long time. Since you can go, like, very, very huge. So, I've decided on, <clears throat> on a simpler design. A cube. Chad has helped me with the proportions, which is 16 by 16. And right now, I'm just kind of figuring out all the power that's gonna be needed for this ship to move around. I feel like in space we're gonna be very good with all of these engines on. I don't know if this thing will be able to land on a planet though. I'm definitely gonna try, like I did with the other ship, which is still stuck on... I mean, it is... I feel like it, the FSTC beacon, that's 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 the ship. It's still stuck on Mars. It's probably going to be there forever. Look at this monstrosity. <laughs> we have... How many sides does this have? It has... One, two, three, four, five, six... six yeah, six. I was like three by three, but I'm not sure. Uh, I think if you put parachutes on one side, you could land easy. True. 
Also, landing gear would help. What is this sound? Is that is that are those the engines? Probably. How many engines do we have? Six times four. Twenty-four. Twenty-four huge ass engines. Cool. Let me put a huge ass gyroscope. Can you make a literally really large one? Is this the big biggest one that you can make? Cool. I'm gonna go a little overkill with this, but I want the best kind of maneuverability ever. So yes, I'm doing this on all sides. Where, when is there gonna be another Blade and Sorcery video? Uh, I mean, I posted one today. Don't know if you've seen it. Wait, not today. Yesterday. Dumb, 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 dumb. It was about the quest mods. So yesterday there have been a video posted. And the next one is coming out next week. I'm already kind of working on it. Also planning on making another mod showcase soon. You've seen it? Nice, nice. Thank you. How did you like it? <laughs> I worked very hard on that video. It was a, there, there was a surprisingly um, a huge amount of cuts made in that video. Alright, we have all the gyroscopes, all, in, all sides, all engines. We have one reactor inside though, so I'm guessing we're gonna need more reactors. First things first though. Let's figure out what's, what's, what is this floor. This is the floor? Okay. So... Nice. How many reactors are we thinking? Because this thing can take a lot of them. <laughs> kind of guessing a reactor in every corner. Just to try it out. Oh, this is so disorienting inside of the... I felt like... Outside it was disorienting, but no, inside it's even worse. Especially when you're flying and everything looks the same. And you don't have any light here. How many corners are in a cube? Eight. I think. Right? Alright, this one doesn't need to be here. Alright, we have... Four reactors. I'm definitely gonna need something that's gonna make uh, 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 gravity inside her, inside of here. The mad version and beta sorcery is cool, but the stuff the normal stuff you can do in beta sorcery before. I mean, yeah, because you have a PC that can go you know, that can do all the all the heavy lifting. When you're when you're playing Nomad, you're literally playing a virtual fighting simulator on a phone that has like. The insides of, of a quest, it looks like it's high tech, but like the the main tech is just like this part right here. And it's literally as big as a phone and pretty much as fast as like a high end phone these days. So like it's amazing what, the, what they can do with the uh, with Nomad, even though it sucks compared to PC VR. Airtight hangar door. Sliding door. Let's just make a door. Can you make bigger door? Bro, pull that out of his inventory. Yeah. <laughs> Blast door corner. Nah. Blast doors. Blast doors. 
Oh, cool. So you can make your own doors, like in actual Minecraft. How does how do these look like? Ah. These are actually pretty cool. And let's just put a block. And bloop. Hey, we have I mean, I know that there should be both of uh, two of these so you know you can have a air tight, you know, place here. But I don't care right now. Right now, it doesn't need to be... doesn't need to make a whole bunch of sense. Alright. <clears throat> Are we ready to put a goddamn flight seat here and try if this thing does something? Yeah, I have, I have a space zone all the time. But if I would be in survival, I would have to have some kind of thing that would uh, provide oxygen into that suit. So I could, you know, repack my suit with oxygen again. So there should, there would have to be something that makes oxygen. And it's also great if you have a gravity field or some kind of a thing that makes gravity inside of your ship. So you don't have to use jetpack all the time or magnetic boots. A toilet seat. I love it. Uh, control seat. You know what? This thing is huge. Let's put a control seat here. And... Everything just got to like turned on. I got I got a little scared. Not gonna lie. Did you hear, hear that sound? It's kind of cool. <laughs> Kennedy, welcome to the stream. This game is called Space Engineers and you can think about uh, think of it pretty much like Minecraft in space with weapons. <laughs> window we want a big window where's a big window bigger a s i don't want a slope i just want a, a three by three flat love it oh wait <laughs> yeah we have a we have a you know is it fun being a YouTuber? Well, it would be way fun if I could only do if I could only do YouTube. But yes, I love video making and making a community and just like create the whole creative process is immensely fun and I love it. But it's only my hobby. I have a real real job that I go to. I go I I have to go there tomorrow as well. And it sucks. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. Just buy my merch and join my membership and maybe one day. <laughs> Joke it, of course. Anyways, let's jump in. Oh my lord, this is the biggest thing I've ever made. <laughs> I love the window in... Oh, we, oh the window is not... Oh. Let's not talk about it. I know it's not, it's not in the middle. Whatever. How can we, can, can we move? That's, can we turn around? Okay. Sub with notifications. Thank you very much, Kennedy. I really, really, really appreciate it. How much does this weigh? 36, wait, wait 3.6 million kilograms. 3.6 million kilograms. The spaceship I repaired before had 1.5. I, I know that I said 150. It was 1.5 million kilograms. And this one has 3.6. More than a double of that. Jesus Christ. And we don't have anything on it, pretty much. So, turning around, it is... For how massive it is, I'm gonna say it's pretty, pretty cool. That's wild. You have half a, half a Saturn V there. Shush. Okay, it doesn't pick up speed as fast as you would probably want to. 
But hey, look at look at the antenna. We are already away. All right, the turning the turning around is horrible. But good thing is that because we have all uh, like same engines on all sides, it means that I can use all of the sides in the same way, pretty much. So I can help with what if I if I if I really want to go fast, I could go like uh, like not straight, but like to the side using both of these sides. And look how much speed we're getting. That's like double the speed. Well, yeah, it's double the engines. So if you if you're gonna go really fast, we're going we're going horizontally, not straight. But the turning around is just oh. I thought that putting all of the gyroscopes on would help us, but. It's definitely not helping at all. I mean, I assume it's cargo ship, so it shouldn't need to be that fast. Is it a cargo ship? Yeah, I know, I know. I mean, it's for how huge and heavy it is, it's still it still moves around pretty well it's just the turning around is horrible i don't know if maybe s like s a bunch of smaller engines on all sides would help it you know but it's so huge <laughs> it's just a enormous looking block all right give me this is right right yeah so let's delete this window and let's put do we have a two by three is it how i think it is because that's exactly what i need yeah it is nice i just need to figure out how to make it go the way i want yes nice now Hey, we got it symmetrical. Came here from Blade and Sorcerer video. Nice, and hopefully you enjoyed the video. I know that this is very different from from Blade and Sorcery, but I am a, a, a variety channel, so expect like if I'm streaming, expect all kinds of games. I rarely stream Blade and Sorcery, but I have a few Blade and Sorcery streams planned actually, so expect that pretty soon. So yeah, videos could be Blade and Sorcery, but could very well be something completely different. Uh, shorts most likely will be Blade and Sorcery for for a while, but I'm also planning on in uh, like putting different series in, and streams are just mayhem. Fortnite stream would be wild. I've never really played Fortnite that much. I have like hundred hours in that, just with friends a bunch. That's it. I have a feeling I should build some kind of a like a staircase and have a, a hand and have a like a mid floor right here and have the glass not down here and uh, but have it right here and have the control center right there you know like so it would be in the middle and not all the way down here but I guess this will make it easier when we're gonna be landing I guess if we're gonna be landing one day Anyways, let me try and put... Yeah. I'm gonna add three engines... Everywhere. Hopefully... Adding enough... Enough extra thrust so the ship can go... To the sides and move around... More easily. I also hope that the smaller engines are not gonna burn the bigger engines, but it should be the, there should be enough clearance. I I would like since you're talking about Fortnite, I would really, really, really love to make the finals stream again, but the one with the when I have a private match and I invite viewers that want to join, because like. 
playing with a bunch of viewers maybe even having uh, like a disc having them all join the discord server so we can chat with 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 each other within teams and stuff like that i feel like that would be really really fun Do you know when it will be? Because final stream would be fun. I, I mean, I'm I'm gonna have to start asking around on Discord and like around around because we're gonna need. I've I've looked at it and the private match needs at least six people and like that's me, you, Michael. That's three. Max. That's four. Then we would need two more. So you know, either tell some so tell someone to download the game and because it's free, you know. So I feel like that that's gonna be like pretty easy. Same thing with Fortnite. When you have a free game and you're trying to uh, let people play it, it's it's the easiest thing to do compared to having someone. Uh, buy like a $60 game and play it with you. That's almost impossible, I feel like. Alright, let's 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 try this turning around. Okay, okay. It's not... I just crashed into my other ship, right? Sorry. Tommy? It'd be cool, but yeah, he, he does... He does seem to be very busy, so... Maybe Fox? Yeah. I could I could probably ask her as well. This thing is actually freaking cool. I didn't know that making a cube looking spaceship is gonna be this cool. By the way, I can also color all of these blocks. So I could literally put like green on top and uh, uh, brown at the bottom. So it def looks exactly like a, like a grass dirt block uh, from Minecraft. Ru <gasps> Rubik's cube. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to like find an image and hope well I mean it's 16 by 16, so are we gonna have how much how many colors do, does the Rubik's cube have? Is it three by three or four by four? Is it four by four? Because is it Oh it's three by three. We can do that, right? 16? No, we can't. We would have to do... We would have to do a Rubik's Cube that's 4x4. Four four. <laughs> you could make a 4x4 four four though. Yeah. I, I, yeah, the standard one is 3x3, three three, I believe. And my girlfriend has told me as well. 3x3 three three Rubik's Cube. Yeah, and f let's see. 4x4 four four Rubik's Cube. Yeah, they do make three four by fours. So yeah, we can we can make just a four by four Rubik's cube. That's gonna be freaking awesome. Probably not gonna do it today because I have to go soon. But hey, I actually did what I said I'm gonna do it in, in the thumbnail, which doesn't happen to me that often. It's not like I clickbait, I just suck at focusing. What is that? Military mine layer? Those are friendly though. Those are not gonna attack us, so I'm 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 not afraid. You also need to leave in a few minutes, nice. So yeah. Next time I'm hopefully not gonna Yeah, it's it's still gonna be visible. Like the colors at the at the corners are not gonna be all that visible, but I guess I could I could paint the engines as well. If it's gonna look any good. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna have like an image of a 4x4 Rubik's Cube or, or a video to see all the sides so I can have something to, you know, grab from. And then I'm just gonna repaint this hunk of junk into, uh, you know, into a 4x4 Rubik's Cube. And of course, I'm gonna be adding a bunch of lighting inside, some kind of an interior. I mean, we have so much space inside that it it needs some kind of things you know in there it's quite barren 
I can't imagine the echo that you would have in a, in a, a, a floating uh, metal box in the space. <laughs> in space. So yeah, there's going to be a whole bunch of things inside. Probably some things outside. I might make something around the corners so they look more, you know, flush with the whole ship. Have a good one, Valen. Thank you very much for thank you very much for joining. Hope to see you in in the next stream as well. Take care. But yeah. Oh, and I also need to add uh, some kind of an entryway for this ship, or we could. I could actually do this right now. You know what? Let me do that right now. It's gonna. It's gonna. It's not gonna take much, much time. Give me landing gear. <clears throat> I need to go now. I'll try and be in the stretch room. Thank you very much, Kennedy. Thank you very much for subbing and being here. Hopefully see you in the next one. Take care, my man. Alright, we have some kind of a landing gear i wanted to put one more right there but it doesn't really fit so let's not actually is this high in the same height no it's not if it would be i would i would i would enjoy it but this works as well all right <clears throat> we jump into this uh so this is the this is the bot oh I forgot how fast this thing goes forward and no other way. Now we turn around. <laughs> this is actually pretty fun. I guess I could I could make some kind of a hatch on the bottom of the of the cube. So I could like literally open it up, jump into it, close it like some kind of an airlock jump into it close it behind me and open it up jump into space and jump into this ship uh and now we descend am i at level yeah hey we got it and turning off Hey! It's not the most stable, I know. Also, I forgot that I have weapons on the right side and no weapons on the left side. Give me a second. I just need to make things right, you know? Where even is it? Like, specifically. Is it like right here? I think so. Yeah, it is. Cool, cool. And rocket launcher. Wait, there was a missile, right? No. All right. Is the rocket launcher that I have on from a DLC? It definitely looks like it. That's wrong though, right? What is this thing? Rocket launcher, yeah. Am I dumb? Is it this? It looks so weird. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. Hey, we got it. Now it's nice and symmetrical. We have all of the stuff needed. Thank you, my man. Thank you very much for stopping by as well. And I'm going as well. 
This is cool. I like the I like the little ship just plopped onto the bottom of the of the ship. It's it, I like it. I see the future in this. All right. Save. Take care, derp. And to you guys, thank you very much for watching. If you would like to follow me anywhere else on YouTube, you can do so by clicking the links down below in the description. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, liking, and all that. If, you, if you're watching the stream recording, uh, let me know in the comments how you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one, uh, also in the next video, and the next short tomorrow. Take care. Join my Discord uh, and follow me on, on Instagram. Yeah, bye. Bye, bye, bye. <laughs>